In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and the Holy Ghost, Amen. Jesus, Mary, St. Joseph, and St. Teresa, pray for us. And St. Gregory, pray for us. Uh, I, I'll show you the saint of the day link down below, but we can read about him. I just only started reading about him today. St. Gregory of Narek, I think his name is pronounced. And there's St. Catherine of Genoa yesterday, who's a wonderful saint, who I still need to learn more about. But anyway, these Luz de Maria prophecies talk about how it's going to be a really hot summer and we can always see already see with these heart machines people are considering the fact that maybe it's it's giving us these little heat waves in late winter early spring already it's been you know over 70 degrees here last week which is really rare and the trees are starting to bloom earlier than I've seen in past years so anyway I totally recommend getting some sunscreen this summer because you don't want to burn, okay? It's really uncomfortable to burn, and it's really bad for the skin, especially with all the rays. They, they say that there's, uh, I read in the prophecy that, that there's these solar flares that are causing the northern and southern lights a lot. Those can't be really good either. And I totally recommend this sunscreen. And the reason why I'm putting this on <laughs> is because I've gone through so many sunscreens that just simply don't work, and they, you know, they clog your pores, and they, they just they're sticky and it's almost impossible to get it off well this stuff seems to be not as bad that's why I say it's kind of you got to pay for it uh, but this says it's also a hundred per 100 SPF and I don't mean to laugh because it's a really sad thing that we have to do this 100 SPF I never heard of that when I was 10 or 12 going to the you know the store to Rite Aid or whatever to get some sunscreen but this is what this is where we're at folks and to show you how serious it is I tried to pick some of this up yesterday and it was sold out it was gone so I have to wait for more so it's not just me other people are realizing that this has to you know that that you've got to get goes a stronger SPF to have it do anything and uh, you may want to try this or maybe try one of the others. This is one of the better brands, I think, for sunscreens. I hope it works for you. I know with sensitive skin, it's almost impossible to find a sunscreen that, that will work. But I would recommend wearing it every day, putting it on twice a day or when you go outside. It says every two hours. That's kind of a lot because it kind of does still have a little bit of that, you know, sunscreen stickiness on it. But if you're in the hot sun, you probably would or if you're sweating. Because I heard people put on, I mean, if you're sweating, any any SPF sunscreen is just going to come off. So you'd have to reapply or just wear, wear, wear a lot of shades, too. So I hope, this, I hope this can work for you. Don't burn this summer. It's going to be probably a hot one. May God totally bless you this Lent. Have a wonderful Holy Week and, um, and a blessed day. In the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Amen.